Hi guys. Hey. So I'm in the Langyu Elementary School, and I successfully got the place. Woohoo! So right now I'm just walking back to school, waiting for the students to get up from school to finish school, because. So uh, tourists are not, are not supposed to enter while they're in class. So I'm just walking back here and chill. And uh, wait for two hours, well less than two hours, for them to get off school. Then I can't freaking move in. Holy. I like this peacefulness. Reminds me quite, uh, quite of my childhood. You can see the hell. This cute little painting on the window, or on the windshield. School is pretty modern. They even teach English class. Well, probably they'll do that in every elementary school in Taiwan nowadays. Because I didn't have English class when I was young. But that was back in so many years ago already. So apparently they just need my uh, information, my name and my phone number. That's all. That's all they need. So I'm pretty happy uh, that I got the place and it's pretty easy just to rent it. Yeah. And I thought it's uh, not allowed to do it. Since they said online it's hard to get a place nowadays in the school because too many tourists. But eventually, I think Yale Elementary School doesn't do that, but Langyu Elementary School they can let you do that, so it's pretty nice. But you definitely have to inform first. Well, I would prefer just walk in and ask the um, head minister of the school, and he'll tell you what to do. So let's wait for less than two hours. Uh, until I said I might camp sites. Yeah, see you then. I'm at the side entrance of the school. Pretty cute little hostel. So apparently, you, you can live in each of this little cottage. They have straight seaside view or ocean view. Very nice. Back to the front of the uh, Langyu Elementary School. See, this school is like a blessing. The other side is a high mountain, and the other, and right on the other side is the ocean. Oh, how can you be? Uh, I mean, how 
can one still be in anxiety? So how can one be or having anxiety living in such a place? You see blue sky every day. Currently inside Lion Yu Elementary School. A little bit before five o'clock. The kids just got up work. Hello. Apparently that's the view. Hello 那我们只有到三点五十放学对三点五十差不多啊以前我小时候是我以前我小时候七点半要到学校七点半要上七点半以前来学校啊我们你们也是啊不过我六点多就起床了啊 yeah, I was talking to those kids Two little cute kids So much activity. Apparently, I think they stay school in school for too long. They say they the first uh, the class started at eight forty in the morning, and they got up at four forty in the afternoon. It's a little bit long. I remember when I was in elementary school well actually in school the most class I loved is sports sports and art and music See, that's the whole school, and that's the place I'm gonna stay for tonight. So, hey, so this is all mine. Uh huh, uh huh. Well, the only negative thing about here is I cannot see the sunset view. 
not the sunset, uh, the sunrise. The sunrise is not on this side, it's in the other side of this island. But uh, anyway, the view is awesome. Okay, and I have rooftop, so I'm not gonna worry about running. Because I was worrying about running last night and then, and then I couldn't really sleep. So yeah, I'm gonna catch time and set up my tent. See you guys tomorrow. Or maybe tonight. Maybe tonight after I set up my camp. I know I just want to show off. Sorry. <laughs> well, apparently I like this school better than Yale Elementary School because I don't see any tourists. Weird. I don't see any tourists visit visiting this school. And it's bigger and it's much more quieter. Of course, there's no tourists. And it's beautiful too. The building has a lot of interesting design within it. So yeah, enjoy it while I'm walking around. So apparently this is my tent. I just set it up. And it's over 6 o'clock now. And I guess the sun will be set at 7. Close to 7. So I gotta hurry up to cook something for myself to eat. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Well, I got sunburned on my nose. I didn't notice it. Till I look at the camera myself and... Alright, it's all red. And the same with my arm. It's probably gonna be hurt tomorrow. Yeah, I have to get the sunset. It looks really red. It looks yellow on the camera, but it looks red in real life. Like... Golden orange. Here's the whole view. Hi guys, it's close to 6 right now, so it's already broad daylight. I wake up late today because well, last night I didn't sleep well again because the wind blowing so strong and my tent starts flopping, flopping, making a lot of noise. And yeah, I didn't sleep good again. So, yes, that the sky already brightened up. And I have to rub it up and get going at 6 because that's what I promised to the school administrator that I have to leave before all the students come to school so let's get going bye so now I'm going back Going back to Yeyo Elementary School. Well, actually to Kaiyuan Harbor, to where I work, where I'm gonna work. Cause, yeah, I have a bunch of files loading. I need to get them on my laptop and publish something on YouTube. Hopefully I can do that because my laptop's really old. It takes a long time to load or to upload or download or even, you know, editing the footage. So 
there's a problem with last night. The place was great. It's so remote. I mean, not so remote, but there were absolutely no one bothers me. But the problem is because the platform that I slept on, that I cannot have my exterior tent you know, nailed down to the ground. So the wind is blowing hard to my exterior tent and it's making this, making it very noisy the whole night. Eventually I didn't get much sleep though, but I did sleep, I did, I did slept because I dreamed. I knew I dreamed, so that's why I didn't fall asleep probably for two, three hours. Yeah, otherwise the place would be wonderful. The restroom and the drink fountain is nearby, just right next by. And the platform is clean. No, there's not, unlike, unlike the sandy beaches, always got sand in my shoes, stuff like that. The only thing is just the wind is blowing. about get down to the water but I have no shower place I'm not sure what what I'm gonna do after I got up the water the salty water will make the skin really sticky so I think I will do that once I start to work so I have a place to shower Today I finally found my hat. Like yesterday I wanted to use it but I didn't know where I put it in my backpack. So I didn't use it yesterday. And my nails really got burned out. Right now it looks like Santa Claus. I have a red nose. in this place. And use the restroom here. I think I found something. Oh my god, I think I found something, you know, I only I only see when I was a child and they have actually they have this plant abundant here which is I believe it's this plant. Look, watch. If I touch it. Look. How fun is that? 
I used to have that a lot in my neighborhood when I was young, but then I don't know why they disappeared after I grew up. Probably I need special clean place to grow, but they have bond in here, okay? We coat it, I'm not sure how we coat it, but we coat it in Chinese. It's like, oh, it's spiky. Oh shit, that's, yeah, stink my finger. We call it shy plant. It is shy because you touch it, it shrink. How fun. I used to love to play this, play this plant <laughs> when I was young. Never see the flower of it. Nice. Okay, I'm gonna take rest here. So, see you. Bye. So apparently, this is a nice place to take a rest. It's Taidong Province Langyu Registration. Not sure how to call it, but this building has restroom and free electric you can charge your stuff i'm wondering do they open do they have their restroom open 24 hours i don't think which i don't think so so yeah it's not a decent place overnight but it's a good just to take a rest there and of course they have drink fountain drink fountain too I found these two statues. Two statues. It's very funny because look, they have they have glasses. Sunglasses have them and the hat. And this one too. They have a pretty car, scarf, a necklace, and them. They're cute. Whoop. to find my next camping site I already had in mind that what where I'm gonna camp it's by the beach side a long way that I ride here thought it's a beautiful spot to see maybe I can see sunset there although there's no restroom but I'm fine because it has fresh water. Fresh water. That's the matters. Most matters. I was at uh, Langyu Elementary School. I'm not sure if you guys hear me, the wind is blowing hard. Uh, anyway, Langyu Elementary School is closer to the mountain. So, find out that if I turn on my headlamp, my headlights, head, headlights, there were so many bugs and mud flying to my face. Incredibly, I, like there were just um, suicide. Ah, uh, 真的吗? 真的没有气了吗? Oh, hold on, guys. Hmm, funny. Yeah, they told me my tire, my. Uh, back tire, lag of air. So I'm gonna find a spot to hmm, to pump in some air. Still have a uh, repair shop. Can kind of repair my bike. No wonder it's hard to ride. I think it's also probably because my backpack's heavy.
Damn, I just, I just wanna stop and check. Is it really out of there? Oh yeah, it is kind of soft. Okay. I like the view here. Look at this. seen this the other day yeah Hopefully my bike can walk me through this whole trip. It can last for three months. This crappy bike. Told you I bought it really cheap, like 70 bucks US dollars. Yeah, the reason I get a small bike is so because it can be I can bring it on the train with me without charge <laughs> and uh, I can just fold it bring it with me to the bus maybe I haven't tried it yet because this bike is not light it weighs 14 kilo oh I see now the stores are open they open after noon in the afternoon Fairly I'll have plenty of chance to enjoy the food here. So right now I'm just camping in my noodles. Eat it all. So my back backpack can be lighter. survive with the traffic. I shouldn't say all oh, but yeah, those grow up in this environment. So it's so this instinct comes naturally with them.
to cover the back of my hands because they really get sunburned. Like my nose. If I touch, if I touch them, it hurts. Oh, it's no store here. To adjust my hats because it's on the wrong way. Her shop I closed. ride bike around the island <laughs> bike around the whole island no I haven't I even I haven't even biked half of the island because with this bad backpack 
it is so heavy.